I'm just gonna try to shoot that on. Oh my god, he left net. Nice. Car is crazy shooting. Ooh, challenge you? Oh my god, dude. This guy. This guy's toxic. He's gonna go. Watch the double tap. He went for it last time. Oh no, this guy doesn't know how to read it. Oh my god. Oh, what a save. I'm Vati Goat. All right, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the YouTube channel. Now, ignore the mess in the background. I am packing to get ready to go home for the summer, so I'm sorry about all that, but. Anyways, before we get into this video, I wanted to say that I'm doing something that I've never done in a YouTube recording before. I'm using the Fennec. Now, there is a good reason for this. It's because Blood thinks he's Vati, as you can see from the preset name. Uh, we got the Fennec, we got the Bluster Bar, we got this color, we got this color, Anodized Pearl, Anodized, Anodized Pearl, Anodized, and Christianos for the wheels. We're gonna see if this car really makes me play like Vati Goat. So we'll get right into it and I'll see you all in the game number one. All right, getting into game number one. Let's see if this car really does make me play like Vati Goat. Playing against Doo Doo Fartington. We got Exert, and we're playing against AV on the other team as well. So this will be interesting. Let's uh, try to just play smart here, conserve boost when I can, and, and just try to read the whole play. Um, should be fine. He should be able to help me out. Bump. Uh, I can't really do too much to help him there. I need him to take a 50 there or something. But because he like gave the ball away, it's just not going to be a good spot uh, for me to be able to follow it up. So we kind of just have to give away possession. All right, hopefully he can just solo that. Nice. Good flip. I'm just going to take this back because I don't have a lot of boost, right? I, I don't want to just take a shot that's not going to be good at all or anything like that. Uh, I would rather just take take the ball back and, and get some boost and, and try to set up a play plus that also gives my teammate time to get back because if i were to take a shot on low boost then i wouldn't be able to recover uh and he would probably be left in a 2v1 situation with low boost flick demo no oh that would have been clean it would have been a lot cleaner if i just got like a banger musty flick 140 kph but i don't even know if that's possible to be honest all right, he's going to beat me. Nice. I'll try to bump this guy. I can't get him. I can't get the doo-doo fart on a bump. I need him to help me out, though. I really need him to help me out. Um, being left in a 1v1 situation in 2s is a lot different than being in a 1v1 situation in 1v1s. Mostly because in 1s, you have time to set yourself up for like a good shadow defense or something like that. But in twos, it's pretty much just like you have to play the shot. I mean, sometimes you'll, you'll be able to have time, but uh other times you will not i can't he's gonna have a double tap that's off just play the ball he missed it unlucky unlucky there i, I just no boost on the backboard so i kind of had to just try to dive at something or i could have sat on the backboard i guess which would have been smarter but i was scared that he was gonna have like a really really nice shot uh he should be able to beat that oh he missed the corner boost that's fine hopefully he can stay on i no, can't hopefully he can go for that Nice, good 50 from us, good speed. All right, I have 17 boosts here, so I'm just gonna try to shoot that on. Oh my god, he left net, nice. I'll take that, I'll take it, let's go. Car is crazy shooting. <laughs> That's funny because I just tried to do a ones recording and I missed like five open nets in a row and I rage quit the recording. That's why that's funny. <laughs> I was blaming the car for the shooting the whole time, but now, now I, I see. I see that the car is crazy shooting. All right, leave it. Don't, don't. Good, let me follow up on the ball. Wait, I'm an egoist. I'm Vati Goat. Oh, oh my God. That was almost crazy. All good, though. Tough, tough, tough. Maybe he can shoot that? Oh, close. All right, he can take that now. Turn on it. Maybe just try to... Okay, I don't know why Dudu was, was pre-jumping that, but it should be okay. And it should roll up the wall. I'll be able to get this and just control this. Hit it mid, he can go now. Nice. Try to just go for one more touch if he could. Uh, like, I need him to either go for it or get out immediately. Uh, when he hesitates, it just makes my life a lot harder. Open net? Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Let's go. Looks like I'm Vati Goat and this guy is Zen with a Vitality decal. Oh, brutal. Uh, okay, he's going to go there. I'm on pads now, so I should be able to... No. I'm awkward. Okay, nice. That was a bad shot from me. Just hit it really wide. It didn't really have a lot of 
power threat behind it. So, so the two ways you can make shots threatening is if you put it either on target or close to target. Uh, and if you do that, they're going to have to challenge you. Or if you like dribble the ball close to their net. If you do any of those three, uh, two things or three things, I guess, they're going to have to challenge you. Um, and they're going to have to send one of their cars out for it. You know, like if, if obviously if a shot's on net, one of them is going to have to go for the ball. Otherwise, it's just going to go in their net. And if you put it close enough to the net that they think it's going to go in, they're also probably going to send one of their cars. So either of those two situations is pretty good for you because if you're taking one of their cars out of the play, well, then they're not going to have somebody to follow up. And then maybe the next shot you get is uncontested. And then maybe the, uh, you know, say that shot somehow saved on the goal line. Well, then the next shot's going to be uncontested because that person's out of commission for a while. So... That's kind of the the basis of, of what like pressure is in this game. Uh, the more the more shots you get on target, typically, unless it's like a really weak shot that they can control, if you shoot it hard enough that they can't control the ball after the shot, then it's gonna get you a lot of pressure because the person who just shot it isn't gonna be able to. Wow. Okay, that's an interesting strat. There. Uh, that's probably gonna be game number one, but I guess they're not forfeiting. Okay, nice, GG. All right, game number two so far, so good. Also, I'm sorry about the mess in the background. Uh, I'm about to move out of my current apartment tomorrow and things are kind of crazy right now, so. Nice, good save there. I'm gonna wait. I'm behind him, so if he forces high, should be good, nice. See, remember when I was talking about shots that, um, like putting a shot on net that the opponent couldn't control? So right there, that was, Oh, okay. That was an example of a shot that I could control. The ball was away from his car and it was, you know, I was on the backboard. So because of that, literally all I had to do there to avoid a, um, the ball going in my net or avoid them controlling the ball or anything like that was just drive on the wall and get a small touch away from him, right? That's all I had to do. So because of that, I didn't even have to commit my car that much. And then the follow-up wasn't that big of a deal. You know, because I was able to stay on the car, get a 50, you know, maybe get some boost. I don't really remember what I did. That was 10 seconds ago. That's a long time. But that's the basis of, you know. Oh, my God, dude. This guy. This guy's toxic. This guy's toxic, man. He, he did not like his last teammate. Wow. Okay. Uh, but, yeah. I mean, that's the basis of, like, pressure. And, and there's a lot of situations where you have a lot more time than you would probably think. So, you might panic and hit the ball away when you really don't need to. All right, he should be able to go for that. I was hoping, I was hoping he would be close, but I can, I can dive in here, and then I should be able to get this again. I'm not gonna have like a, a dribble or anything like that, but I can clear it out and get it over that guy, so they at least don't have, uh, they at least don't have like a bunch of pressure. Uh, I'm actually gonna take this from him because he looked like he was a little bit awkward, although I didn't really get the best touch. I'm just gonna leave that. I don't know whether or not he's going to get a strong enough touch for me to take the ball off of him there, so it's better for me to just... Nice. Good save. I would just save my flip uh, so I could react to however he used his flip reset. Uh, in that case, I was able to just challenge the ball as he was using his flip, so I was able to just 50 it out. I need him to just go for the ball here. Nice. Very good challenge. Right there, if the guy goes over him, I can always get it, and if the guy goes like around him, I can also get it, so... I just need him to go for the ball there. The only situation in which he scores is if my teammate gets faked out and then he has a shot on the net before I can even react. I need him to jump. Nice. Nice. Very well played. Good defense from us as well to get that goal line save. It was a little bit weird because he like faked touching the ball uh, and I was kind of leaning towards his touch. Uh, but it works out, you know. I'm going to fake this. Go back. Nice. Try to demo this guy. Oh, fake that. Oh, uh, I can go for this. Go fast. Nice. I'm going to fake going for this as well. I mean, I'm, I'm going to use my boost to, to stay on it, but... All right, I'm going to touch that over. He can go. Nice. Good of him to stay on the backboard. I'm pretty sure he's at zero boost now because otherwise he would have used his boost there to get a better touch. All right, nice. Save my flip there, and I actually used it to go down. Oh, that's a good double. That was tough. He, he just had no boost. He needed to get pads like while I was challenging that ball. Uh, but because he had no boost here, he literally just couldn't even jump for that. If he was on the backboard, it would have been fine. But again, that's a tough spot to be in. 
All right, he's he's down. I'm just gonna hit that high. I mean, it's not the most powerful shot on net to be honest. I could have gotten a much better shot, but even just hitting it high and forcing him to jump for it uh, is a really big help. All right, just back. All right, he went. That should be fine. Nice, good beat. Oh no, he backflips. Eh, it should be all right though. Um, I got a little bit too close there. I thought he was gonna go. All right, he's gonna have a touch. All right, should be free for AV. He can turn here. Yeah, he can go now. Nice, good pop high. Maybe just go for a demo or go for a double. I gotta fake that. Oh, I gotta watch the demo. No, 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 no. Bump. Okay, we're chilling. I'm gonna go for a flick here. Actually, since he pre-jumped, I'm just gonna fake that, go for a bump. All right, that's a bit weird, but I'll take it. I mean, that's a fine, fine challenge for me, if I say so myself. He's gonna go, watch the double tap. He went for it last time. Oh no, this guy doesn't know how to read it. Oh my God, oh, what a save. What a save. Oh my God, I'm ridiculous. I'm Vati Goat, defensive MVP. I don't even think he was defensive MVP. I think he, uh, he was offensive MVP. Double? Fake? Oh, over. Top. No, okay, that's fine. Still forced him to commit, so, you know, it, it, it builds pressure. I had to fake that. I thought he was a lot closer. All right, low boost here. He's gonna hit around. If I get his boost, should be fine. I also bumped him a little bit, which kind of messed up his recovery. All right, soft touch. He's awkward, he's awkward. Free shot, free shot, free shot. Oh, we're good. We got the double. Nice. I, I didn't think I got over that enough, but I, I hit it into the crossbar and then doubled it. So we're, we're chilling. We're chilling. That was really nerve-wracking. I'm not going to lie. Because if I miss that off the crossbar, then, you know, they just score right on us. So we're good. We're good, though. Careful, AV. Um, should be fine. I don't think he has boost to follow that. Like, the zomb guy. Or zombie. Oh, no. That's not good. That's my bad. He missed. He missed. He missed. We're chilling. Uh... I'll just take the... Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. I covered everything there. I'm not even worried about that. Now, why am I getting the mid-boost? I don't know, but hey, it works out, all right? We'll get right into game number three, and I'll see you all then. All right, getting right into game number three. And we got Sinsa on our team. This will be an interesting game. Saldo Jets is a very high-ranked player. Uh, I, I don't know if he plays as much anymore, but he's probably still very good. So, I'm going to try to take a 50 here. Nice. He kind of rushed me. Uh, so I didn't really get the 50 I wanted, but I can go for this fast. Shoot it on. Try to get his boost. Nice. I'm just going to touch that back because, you know, it's it's not perfect. Dude, you got to hit that. Okay. A little awkward here, but bump. Ah, I couldn't get the bump. Unlucky. I don't think this is the pro player speed, um, but I'm not really sure. I don't know. Again, I don't even know if he plays anymore. So is he on a pro team right now? Oh, wow. That's a, that's a good save. Uh, I should be good. I should have this. I know he used to be on Team Liquid, right? I think. It was like him, Fruity, and... Was it Flakes? I don't even know. I, I didn't really follow EU back then. I still don't really follow EU, but like I know all the top teams now. Uh, but yeah. Can he go? Okay, I'm just gonna take this. Oh, that's that's not great. I have no boost, so he can take that. I want to leave that for him because he's gonna have a more perfect setup. Plus, he's also gonna be able to see whether or not the opponents are actually challenging there. Uh, so it's better if he just takes it. All right, he tried to go for a pogo on me. Come on now, just go, just go for the ball. Nice, good challenge. In what universe is that guy anywhere near me? He literally just breathed on me and I got demoed. Nice shot. Let's go. Is that the pro speed? He has 80 ping, so maybe. Let's check it out. This is a uh, speed. Doesn't look like. No, he's from California, so no. Not the pro. Not the pro player. All right, I'm going to watch for the back right kickoff there. Yeah. Uh, I saw that coming because Salado went for the back boost. And, and like I always preach, if, if somebody's going for the back boost, you should always be looking for the back right or left kickoff. Uh, and ways to counter it is basically just by trying to force it towards the other side. Uh, and then the kickoff will either stall or, uh, you know, it just, it just won't. It'll either like stall or it'll basically just do that where 
it still goes to their side, but it's not a great, uh, my bad, my bad, my bad. I was, I was distracted about kickoffs, man. I'm not Johnny boy. I'm not, I'm not preaching about kickoffs. All right. Three minutes left and it's tied up. They're going for a fake. Okay. Uh, since, uh, whoa, buddy. Whoa, Nelly. I got to wait here. He's probably going to be able to go. Nice. Just got to chill. All right. He's going to stay on. I'll go one more. Can this guy go? No, I guess he couldn't. He was getting boost. All right, again, I'll just try to maybe just get a 50 or something. It's best I can do with how little boost I had. I mean, I'm not really going to be making any crazy plays off the wall with 20 boost. I mean, I guess I could, but nice shot for my teammate. This guy's doing crazy things. I guess I'm not really being Vatira right now. I'm more of just, uh, I'm more of being like Itachi or something, you know, just like assisting Vatira. Got Vatira on my team. This crazy preset turned my teammates into Vatira? Vati Goat. Sorry, I'm just thinking of like clickbait ideas right now. Oh no. That's so tough. That's so tough there. No problem. I didn't expect that ball to go uh, like, like there, I guess. I'm not really sure. All right, good touch. And I'm gonna be able to follow this. Hit it off the wall to make it awkward for him. Try to get a 50. He might be able to go here, just don't overcommit. He overcommitted. Um, gonna have to wait for this. I can't get that. No, oh, he can't, he can't, he can't. Hit it across, hit it across, hit it across. Nice. Hit it over one. Let's try to play the miss. Wow, what a touch. I'll just hit it across now, hopefully. Uh, yeah, nice, good from him. Uh, a bit awkward there. I'm just gonna go back here. Maybe turn on this. I can't. Hopefully he can go for that. Nice. I'll wait. Just turn that around him. Take the full boost. Wait on that. I got nothing here, so I'm gonna just let Salado go. Nice. Low boost, get it around him. Get one more touch. I got zero now. Nice, it's open. Nice, nice, nice. Good play, good play. Let's go, Sinsa. I'm getting carried, aren't I? Oof. I mean, it's not bad, actually. I <laughs> have 420. <laughs> Seriously, it's not funny. Let's go. 50 seconds left. We just got to watch for the kickoff strats. Okay. Oh, yeah. Take this up the wall. And I'm not uh, going to fall. Yeah. Oh, whoa. My teammate missed the ball. Yo, oh my God. Wait, bars. Uh, let me take that. Like I'm Arsenal. Ooh, yo, hold on. Uh, I'm gonna wait here. Uh, he can take that, just, just go. Eh, it's a bit awkward, but I don't think Salda's gonna be able to shoot. Ooh. Oh God, As, uh, I shouldn't have said that, huh? I should not have said that. I knew he was gonna be able to shoot it. I just thought I was gonna be able to get to it. Uh, but I positioned myself kind of horribly. Teammate can go. I guess he wasn't cheating up close. All right, bump one, but he's going to be in a 1v1. He can get that, though. As long as he clears it out to the corner. Nice. Good double tap from him as well. I need a little chain dash, a little wall dash. Nice. Good mechanic. Good mechanic. Okay. That's down. I'm going to watch for the Spanish here. So I'm going to cheat out a little bit. Yeah. Oh, they're going for the fake, not even the Spanish. Salvador's going to have another touch. He's got a flip here. Should be fine, though. I bumped him. I'll let Sinsa take it. I could have doinked it up for him, but it, I saw him like going just straight for the ball, so I knew that I shouldn't. Just going to take a 50. He should be able to touch that. Nice. I got to get some boost here. Uh, Salvador's going to be on that. I got to play the 1v1. He went over. He should be on the backboard. Oh, he's not. Okay. Get a 50. Hit it around one. Just gonna fake this. Hit it over. Should be fine. He can turn on it. Oh, no, he went back. That makes it so much harder for him. Even if he does have low boost there, he's just gotta go for the ball. No, no, no. Uh, I really didn't want him to hit that. It's gonna work out though, because he actually had enough boost to get to that ball. Nice, good 50. K 
can't get that. No, he's going to have. All right. I'm just going to wait here. He should be able to take that. Nice. Okay. Got to wait on this. Got a fake. He can go. Uh, I'm just going to sit behind him here. 60 boost. No, no need to like get too close to him or anything like that. See, 50 pops out for me. Again, he, he can have this touch. I mean, it's not really a big deal. If the ball's in your corner, it's most of the time going to be safe. Uh, unless you get like a really bad 50. But if you're just patient in your own corner, you're not going to get conceded on a lot of the times from that position. All right, he can hit it across. Oh, boy. That's unfortunate. You know what? It's fine. I, I don't really consider that a loss because... That's just a that's just a bad way to lose. It's fine though. It's no big deal. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. See you on the next one. Peace.